a superstar player or the number one player on the team vanished. Every number one player on the team vanished. What would be the best team in the NBA besides the Celtics? Because obviously it's the very easy answer. Take away the Celtics. <laughs> what team would be the best? Clippers. Now, I'm, 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 you said without Jimmy Butler, the team would still be good? Oh, my God. Yeah. That's insane. Nah, nah, you're right. That's insane. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> That's insane. Um, he top five for a reason. Um, so take away Giannis from the Bucks. How they doing? So is Damian Lillard no defense? And Doc Rivers, that's tough. <laughs> Doc Rivers, yeah. that's tough. Yeah, no. Doc Rivers. Before. No, we we got what? How long he been in uh, NBA? What, thirteen years? Lillard. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, one beard grown. Portland. There you go. You say you say the Clippers. It's so Clippers. you take away Kawhi Leonard. I mean, they plot. I I just see. I know it should be, but like, they plot is so awful. You know, what about what about the Suns? What about Devin Booker? Devin Booker and Bradley Beal. What about them? Take I mean, Bradley Beal barely played now. You still got um, KD? No, KD gone. So KD, KD gone, So all you have is Devin Booker and Bradley Bill. That's not oh, what he... Oh, okay, okay. You said no, KD better than Booker. That's not... That's not what no, you're not going to get the top team in the NBA. You're not You're not getting past Denver without uh, Jokic. But no, but no. But <laughs> yeah, not, so like so Jamal. Jamal Murray... You saying Jamal Murray yeah. and Michael Porter is going to beat Devin yeah. Booker and Bradley Bill? Yeah, Bradley Bill can't uh, even stay on the court now. It really is just going to be Devin Booker. Bro, Jokic being away from that team is a very like that shoots a lot of like there th- he is an offensive machine and that's just gone. I I don't know. That's that's a lot to be gone. The Jokic did he play in the bubble? Yes, he did. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, I, mean, I, mean, the bubble, I remember more Jamal going crazy. I don't. Know. He, yeah, he had I he had a great he had that great Jokic. first round against Utah for sure. He did have that great last year. I but remember this, Jokic but, like being the but this Jokic this is this. Dominant. But this Jokic is the bubble, much he, better than that Jokic. He, I, did he? Who carried more in the bubble? I think it was still even. I think first was round even? was Murray. Second round it was like. I don't. I'm Jokic not gonna lie. I don't talking. remember like Jokic being. Like, I don't remember like a game or a series. I was like, damn, Jokic going crazy. Now it last was, year, it wasn't. It wasn't a, last year he, yeah, I was like, they can't. But, but that's stop. how you taking away. You but you taking away that. Yeah, but you I don't take away. Bubble checking, take away. I, don't, I don't see nobody checking Jamal for real. Like, like I've yet to see. Nobody oh, like they got good role players. players. Yeah, like they got they good got uh, Aaron Gordon, Michael Porter Jr. Like Michael, I never passed Porter Jr. You know what I mean? Like there's some there's there's some there's some different pieces out there. What's his name uh, I forgot the other guy name. He pretty clutch. The one that came from the Lakers. Oh, KCP. Yeah. KC, yeah. KCP. He oh, solid right. last year. Going off last year, he played solid. So Christian Braun. Had a... <laughs> I is brown looking. Oh. <laughs> I like them. Right, nah, so but the, look at the Lakers. What about the Lakers? So who's the best players? Anthony Davis or is it LeBron? It's Bron. Um, that's sad. It's that's, that's very sad. Davis. That's very sad, actually. Um, sad, and so Anthony Davis. sad and impressive though. Yeah, Impressively but, sad. No, but Anthony Davis really <laughs> come on, bro. Like Anthony Davis needs to be. It's not even like impressive in sense of like Anthony Davis playing really great and LeBron's playing greater. It's just like Anthony Davis not playing as good as he should and LeBron's playing good. Yeah, maybe this is kept They're not going nowhere. They're not. They can't go nowhere without LeBron. Honestly, so AD AD's not going. AD's not going to turn it up um, without getting injured. So no, then they're not. They're not the best. What about the, what about the Knicks without Jalen Brunson? Julius uh, Randle, boy, he all star, boy, that was an all star. You know, we see lottery, how they they, they always end bad. So. That's a lottery team right there. Uh, okay, or the, or the Nick, Kings they, without they Aaron the Fox. Spot. The Kings without Aaron Fox, I I might, hey, they they will still Sabonis be Sabonis balling. They will Sabonis, still be competitive. Sabonis good. Sabonis lead the league in triple doubles and double doubles. And I'm a fan of Keegan Murray. I think Keegan Murray will still be fine. He'll be cool. Um, yeah, Mavericks being a lottery though. Mavericks being a lot of without it. Um, Luka? Mem- yeah, Kyrie Memphis. Not doing that, bro. No, yeah, the Mavericks are awful without Luca. And uh, Memphis, Memphis without, right uh, it's, it just is what it is. He has, it's what they are. I don't know. Lottery team. <laughs> but <laughs> but, the, but at the same time, they're also playing teams that don't have their player as well. So it changes. <laughs> they, may, they may get more wins off of just that. Um, so uh, the, like you, you can say, we can say the Clippers, the problem with the Clippers, they have such a collection, a collection of such awful plot. I mean, you look, you got James Harden, Russell Westbrook, and Paul George. That what? is some tough plot. No, you say fire. That plot, rough. They find a way. They'll find a way 
to lose the like you, you have a team with the, like a better system but less talent. The less talent team somehow is gonna finesse that. I feel like the Nuggets might finesse that and beat the Clippers anyways, especially like Game Six, Game Seven, James Harden, which is rough. In Game Six, Game Seven, Russell Westbrook, who was also rough, and Paul George. I always remember the man hits the side of the backboard in that freaking Game Seven. Yeah, that's also rough. It's all rough. Kawhi Leonard, the only one with plot there, so I don't know. But uh, I see what you Paul George clutch up last year. Paul George, Paul, I think Paul George was injured last year. I don't think he played in the playoffs. Oh, yeah, I don't recall Paul George playing. Like, yeah, he wasn't one year. What he, oh, he clutched up uh, the year after the bubble. He had a yeah. good year. Yeah, 21. Yeah, yeah, 2021, he, he clutched up for sure. He, play, he played better. That was his one post. Like, they the they last time. His, uh, pandemic P and gave him playoffs. Yeah, they, were, yeah, they removed the pandemic. <laughs> but then the problem was Kawhi was hurt. So it was really just Paul George yeah. by himself for real. That, that was the year to win, too. That's how I know they ain't got no plot. No, Kawhi Leonard, you should stay in Toronto. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. The, that 2019 Toronto team is always just gonna be like a wonderful memory for me. That's a great college memory for me. It's and good they, he they, left, they, though. Why? Because they weren't gonna recreate that. They don't have to look. I feel you like they get plot the one in, and yeah, unless you can recreate, just move on. Now, but the Raptors they were, they were pretty good. You say they what? Were pretty good. The Raptors were pretty good. I believe they're pretty good the next year. They just didn't have their star. They lost to the Celtics because they just didn't have their closer. But it was so magical. Like, I don't, that's the only thing I want to remember. Yeah, I don't want to remember. It was a great story. I would hate for it to get tarnished. That's like, that's like when movies and, and series like try to make like a sequel. Yeah, they have force one. it. Or, yeah, That's like hilarious. they, they period, clearly bro. want to just keep them back. Like they're like, you know what? You go to LA, bro. We don't want you, bro. We don't want to ruin what we had. That little bit of moment we had. They definitely would resign that man for all the money in the world. He yeah, went to I mean, I, of course they would, but I'm just saying, like as an NBA fan, like just leave on a high note. It's okay to I leave. Like that. Bro, yeah. Look at look at this Clippers career, bro. It is rough. I it mean, is. yo, like <laughs> it's rough, boy. I mean, that that was his last moment. That that's that's tough, but. So we're saying, are we saying, you know, Greg, you said Clippers. Are we all agreeing Clippers? Is that the easiest one to just say? Clippers, maybe you might say Nuggets. You think Jamal Murray, that man. Yeah. Maybe the Thunder. What about, you think, what y'all think about the Timberwolves? Absolutely. Without, with, without Anthony Edwards? No, they need Anthony That's Edwards. a lot Towns, That's a lot Towns, Towns, yeah. Towns got no plot. And Rudy Gobert, he's a great defender, but mm. it don't translate in the right way. Yeah. And, yeah. He he needed, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm missing somebody though. I feel like I'm missing a team. Okay, see, I miss how would you, how would you feel about Shay leaving? But like the whole team still there. Oh, they need him. I don't know. They need I mean, him, but 30, they, they would still be competitive. I think thirty and night though. That's a big thirty one. It's thirty one and eight. Thirty one time. Thirty one. <laughs> don't, don't you mess that up. Thirty one. My bad. Yeah, but Chet, Chet and Jalen Williams ain't nothing to play with either though. They not, but like, I don't know. Are they going to win the championship? No, but there's nobody in the East. I'm I'm actually looking at the standings now. There's Timberwolves, no. Thunder. I don't know. No, Pel- what about Pelicans? What about Pelicans without I'm, Zion? Hell no. They ain't cooked them. I wouldn't even want to watch them. <laughs> Steph Curry, no, no Steph Curry on the Warriors. We've seen that before. 2020. Oh yeah. And Draymond <laughs> oh. can't carry. Um, the Cavs. Know what they got going? The Magic. Magic I need think, every ounce of Paulo Benguer. I, <laughs> I think I think I'm pick I'm gonna pick the Kings. I think the Kings have such yeah. a well oiled system. And Sabonis is such a good player that if you just get a decent point guard, don't have to be like all, but just like a decent point guard. I think they overcome the Clippers' talent because the Clippers just have no plot. So I feel like I think the Kings and the well oiled system and that Mike Brown offense. I think they. I'm picking the Kings. That's what I pick. Well, yeah, I'm picking the Clippers. Yeah. Y'all ain't got no y'all ain't got no answers for James Harden. The only pe- the only person that can stop James oh, Harden the is playoffs is the playoffs. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing that can stop James Harden is a series. Um the only person that stop James Harden is a proven winner. There was a game Golden, seven that was starting Golden, the Golden State Warriors. Outside oh. of the Golden State Warriors, who really who really giving James Harden trouble for us? Scott Foster? Look 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 at the cell. I'm this ain't Rockets, James Harden. Look at the Celtics game he had last year. Look at the Heat game he had the year before. And look, look, look at all these losses. They're ridiculous. He had nine points in that game seven, bro. I said, bro, you don't have to be, you don't have to win, bro. Just put up like 25 
Like, you know what I'm saying? Even if it's inefficient, like, why do you have nine? Why in these closeout games you have sub-10 points when you're James Harden? But yeah, in game man. one, he had 45, and in game seven, he has nine. Like, and bro, I'm, like, it, I it get just goes that. down. I understand that. Down. But when we talk about Philadelphia, every time, bro, every time we talk about Philadelphia, you're talking about it and be injured. And this is why he's not in my top five. Y'all here. Went right back to that. James, Harden, went back James to that. Harden got to put up 40 one night, and then we get mad. Why he ain't dropped 40 or 25 in game seven? There wouldn't be no nine. game seven. There wouldn't be no game seven if Embiid was healthy. But because but he he's not. Nine. I know. This is there, like, wouldn't, this a- there wouldn't be no game seven if there wasn't that one. I'm saying, like, I'm not, I'm not saying that James Harden, you know, if you have to rely on James Harden to be your number one, Bad things gonna happen. I know. <laughs> I, I've lived it. <laughs> yeah, Almost but you, you can't give us good, and then when we, you know, you show us what you're capable of. The only thing that changed is the game. Like it's game seven. It's it's the most important game. And boy, you, you can drop forty five on in game one. I mean, what's the point if you're not translating into? And he had like opportunities. He had shots. He was just missing. Yeah, James, Harden, yeah, James Harden reminds me of them niggas that would um, just would be late to the start test. Like, they would just miss the whole day. Like, bro, it's a start test, bro. Like, you could literally... <laughs> like, we know that you can pass this test for real. You just did not show up today. Why didn't you? And he just shrugged his shoulders. I just didn't feel like it today. He gives you a little sponge about me. I didn't really feel like it. That's really what James Harden really be. That's why everybody be pissed off. I'm like, bro, like, all you have to do is just be there, and you're not. So. Just, just give me your average. That is the simplest thing you can ever ask a human. Just give me your average. I don't want you. You don't have to drop 60 or 50. Bro, you average 22. You average 25. You average 30. Bro, just do it again. <laughs> just please do it. If you If he did that, I promise I'd be a much happier person. I swear to you. I'd be a happier person in my life if this man did that. Just brought his average. <laughs> That's it. But yeah, my man, my man went below nine points. Is like what fifty percent below his average, seventy percent below his average. Like this. Come on now. I ain't gonna you get to that. That's funny though. <laughs> I bring back great memories. Ricio, I bring back a great memory when I played y'all, and I had he had eleven points in that game six. I said, bro, <laughs> this man, this man is like, what's happening, bro? Like, why? You average twenty nine. Why now? Like, <laughs> like why not average? I put twenty nine in this game. 